Hello everyone, it's Emma, and today we're discussing solving DNS problems. If you want to understand what's going on in your network, you need to be able to perform DNS queries. The best way to do so is by using the Network Administration tool, NSLOOKUP. This command line tool can help you better understand network problems and aid you in solving them. Some of the common use cases of this tool include getting the A record of a domain, checking NS records of a domain, getting the SOA record of a domain, and finding MX records. In this video, we'll cover all of these use cases and we'll be working on the command prompt environment of Windows. So stay tuned. Number one, getting the A record of a domain. In the command prompt environment, type NSLOOKUP and hit enter. As a result, you'll see your default server and your IP address. Then type in a website's domain name to get the IP address. Here, I'll use Instagram's domain as an example. Number two, checking NS records of a domain. In this step, you'll learn to find the authoritative name server of a domain name. First, type set q equals ns. And in the next line, type a domain. Number three, getting the SOA record of a domain. Getting the SOA record of a domain is similar to the last command. The only difference is that you set the query type to SOA instead of NS. So the first line of command would be set Q equals SOA. And for the second line, type the domain name. Here, I use Pinterest domain name as an example. Number four. Finding MX records. A mail exchange record or an MX record tells you which mail server is responsible for receiving emails. For this use case, you should set the query type to MX. Set Q equals MX, and then type your domain name. 